Hello everyone, I'm Nate Asher, and welcome back to Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Master of Time. I've been getting uh, questions about people wondering what's going to happen to this series now that uh, we've started Skyward Sword HD, and uh, the answer to that is what happens to all the ROM hack series. Uh, they're usually just like I don't uh, schedule them whenever I record them. Like my um, the main series, which is always um, a main official Nintendo license Zelda uh, game. And uh, I was just doing this on Fridays while we were waiting for Skyward Sword to release. Um, usually, ROM hacks I just do is kind of like a thing during. Man, it's dark in this dungeon, isn't it? Hang on, let me fix. Little much. Hang on. Um, Oh, that's good enough right now. <laughs> um, but anyways, the um, ROM hack series that I do are usually just for like, just like a fun thing to do while we wait for like the next upload of the main Let's play. So, rather than scheduling these when they're finished uploading, I will just post them as soon as I'm done recording and editing them. Man, there's so many doors in here. <laughs> I guess we just pick one. Where'd we come in? That'd be. Came in here, so we'll just go to the left. Okay. But yeah. So. The only, the only, like, downside or negative to the change would be if I was too busy or too tired to upload a Master of Time video that week, but, um, the positive is that that also means that there could be multiple videos Master of Time videos a week, and I'm dead. Um, and they can be any day, so you don't have to wait for a specific day. Right, anyway, enough about that. Hard enough to. Did I get them all? There we go. Don't see anything in there? Oh, there's a Gibdos. Can't get him. Hmm. Is this supposed to be here so I can't get up there? Nice try. Um. Okay. Ooh wee. <laughs> yeah, you can definitely tell how bright I had to turn it up. I really 
if I'm being honest, I didn't uh, actually change the brightness at all. It, they just um, had to really would it be like a high black point. I'm not like you know super knowledgeable about all the stuff, but all I know is I pretty much just had to turn the gamma up. Alright, dude. That worked. Dang. Now, see, can we get out? If there's something to hook shot onto out there, I could get out. Like I could weird shot out. Oh, wait. Okay. Whew. Not what I tried to do, but, um, anyway. Dude, there's so many. It's like it's okay. This is a maze. Where did I come out of? Came out of here, right? So let's just go to the next door. This is a different this is a different area but it looks the same what the heck? Hey, we have 
Where I came from. Walked all the way around. Yes, the only way to go is through here. Yay! <laughs> Love this guy. There's always like a really tiny window, it's like two or three frames that like he's vulnerable right before he goes back in as well. It's so hard to hit. Alright, where did that chest go? Way over here in the freaking shadow. Said, hoping he was wrong. Okay. <laughs> Wait. How do I open this barred door? I don't. anything that would open up. But it has to be in this room just based on how Zelda Ocarina of Time works. I just don't see a switch or anything. There is another explanation for why it could be barred, and that's that it 
is a one-way door. So, we will just go with that so that we can continue on. You don't think I can climb over this? Alright. Okay, maybe I can't. Whoa, dude. That's how you're gonna greet me as soon as I come home? Dude, for real? Okay. Dude. Dude! It was a one-way door. <laughs> All right, let's. Dude, we need another bottle. Actually, I'm gonna be wreck. Okay, I'm back. So while I was away, I was thinking about that room with the eyes that were shooting fire, and I remember hearing something that I thought was weird. I figured it was like, just like a custom change in like the sound effects or whatever but like I heard like like a ugh, like like an enemy even though there weren't any enemies other than those eye switches so um let's go back there and maybe I, I keep forgetting that this is kind of like a shadow temple thing so maybe we we're supposed to use the um the lens of truth. Go on the right way. Aha, <laughs> uh -huh, there weren't other things here. Here, we need to, um, Crap, I just realized that now we can't see them. <laughs> You're gonna have to just spin attack. 
spam spin attacks because I used Neighbor's Love and forgot that we needed the uh, Lens of Truth to even see them. Yes, we got him. Alright, I'm getting sick or allergies or something. Cool. Nice. You guys notice that that drains your life, even if you have neighbor's love? Isn't that cool? Now, where am I? This the this back to the I think we're back at the entrance. So all that to open a different door. Nice. Oh, and we're about to get taken by Wallmaster. Okay, because we need to heal anyway. <laughs> All right, well, now that we did all that, we can go <laughs> in that door apparently. So, we'll be doing that next time. So thank you guys so much for watching this episode. Uh, if you enjoyed, please leave a like. I would really appreciate it. And um, I will uh, do my best to get back on track with uh, this uh, particular ROM hack. I don't, I don't know how many people are still interested, uh, I know a few people are, um, and it is really cool, and I, I like playing uh, new Zelda content, you know, any day, so I'm, I'm down, uh, but I will, uh, I'll do my best to keep up with it, it's, uh, it's been hectic for me lately, but, um, I'm getting things more, more, uh, secure, stable, situated, so, um, yeah, again, like I was saying earlier, ideally these will just be uh, uploaded uh, as I finish them. So, and again, the main series will continue to be Friday mornings at 5 Eastern. So, um, but anyways, I will see you guys next time.